today I'm going to be doing a um, project life spread and I've got the Becky Higgins Bohemian Adventure that I'm going to use today. I picked this one because I thought it had some good elements for boys and girls in it. Um, there were some really pretty, obviously, girly ones, but I wanted something a bit more um, universal. So this is the third layer I've done for my little cousin. Well, will be my third layer. And I just want to show all the different things that you can do with scrapbooking um, to help find what works for you. So this is my first layer. Uh, this is the second layer that I did. So these are obviously one page layouts. And you could just do those for special pictures or you can do them for all of your pictures um, but today with the project life I'm going to show you that if you have um, say a big event or you go on a trip you can use uh, these to put all your photos in rather than doing a big spread per photo so they're very easy very simple I don't imagine this will be very long so what I've done is I've gone through the pack and um, picked out bits that I think would look quite cool or are more, I would think, as a boy type thing. And yeah, if you wanted to see what's in this pack, I've actually done an un unboxing of it, so I'll link it in the um, comments of this video. Okay, so I've got a few photos here to put in. Um, I think after this I'll only have one more photo to do. So <clears throat> let's get started. So I've got the one week old today and one month old today. So I've decided to choose that photo. And I've just gone through and cut out some bits and pieces to use. But I'm just I'm just going to go and I'm just going to work through these bits and pieces and you'll see as I go um, how I'm going to do this. But they're all from the same kit. So, and apart from these two which are... Um, milestone cards from my shop um, and that's just shimmery black card stock and this is cork that I just cut to the size of the pockets okay
Yeah, so I'll just talk you through my thought process that I had for this while I was doing it. I thought it was actually going to be a lot harder than what it was um, because I'm using someone else's things rather than and putting you know their work together rather than using things that I've made and put together but it was actually very easy and very simple um, yeah and I'm actually quite happy with how it came out in the end it's a bit simple simpler than some of the stuff I normally do but that's fine sometimes it's quite nice to just do something rather than put the puzzle pieces together rather than think so yeah that's quite cool so I wanted you can see there that I'm doing the sort of pattern the the, the cork the black the cork the black And I didn't actually look at this um, what's it called Project Life Pack too much too in too much detail when I bought it, but it's actually worked out really well. I should probably actually trim that off a bit. Trim it off this side actually. Hopefully that's not too much. <coughs> But yeah, I'm just quite happy with how it's all come together. Obviously having the quite neutral milestone cards means that they will go with any sort of layout. Um, and it can make your kits and everything last longer. Because um, you're using those instead of all the, the other cards that are in there. So these you meant to put your the, these are designed so you can put your journaling on the back of the cards, but it doesn't matter if you do it messy or whatever because you you can transfer your um, journaling from the back of that card and, and write it out nicely on this part here. So that's what I've done this layout for. So and you can do the same thing and um, pop some cards in the back so you can't actually see what's on the back of those cards or your messy writing but you've you've written your journaling at the time when you've taken the photos um yeah so you don't forget when you come back later to put them together because we all have these visions of when we have a kid that we'll have all this time to do these things well we don't um as i found out but that's okay so yeah i was really happy with how this worked out so obviously these are in order on the um, pack so we've got one week old today which relates to the same photo that she's um, my cousin's taken here and I've used so this arrow was going the right way pointing to um, him here but this arrow was going the wrong way so I put one of the gold arrows and pointed to him being one month old down here and I thought well I'll just make the match pointing to the respective pictures so that was that thought process then I it just sort of worked out that way but this one here I've got a journaling card and you can sort of see that I've ended up bringing those tones in here with this this bit here and um, this one's quite neutral but it's yeah a bit more neutral with the um, greens and everything like that so that was sort of the colour theme and yeah and whatever I these are similar but different so I sort of just carried them through to these two you can see there the chevrons and the banner and then the same here I've sort of started with a, a banner both here and then I've put a couple of sentiments and then yeah and I've put the remember today um I really wanted that one there because it had the 
arrow pointing towards what was going to be written on that for that day so that's my thought process and how I sort of put things together and yeah I really liked that star there just to fill in that sort of blank space that was there so today's adventure one month old and I thought that that's that saying actually went quite well with the whole elephant not that you can see him now that I've covered him up uh, this one says everyday moments this one says special moments this one says love you to the moon this one says daydream and the arrow pointing to him and he's actually sleeping and I think it's the daytime so that works quite perfectly hopefully I'm right um, and then we've got memories my life pointing to the remember today and hello so I hope I've given you some uh, inspiration today if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you would like to get notified when I have future videos make sure you um, subscribe to my channel um, so you can get notified straight away thank you so much for stopping by today and yeah I'll see you next time bye